see anybody. Oh, you know what? We're a vampire. Why don't we uh, use our hunter's sight? Boom. Ah, so night eye and detect life. So there's, you see these, uh, everything's blue so we can see better. And you see those uh, splotches of light that are smearing around over there? That's the enemies, that's people. And that's people, creatures, anything that's alive will show up right there. So, whoop. Gotcha. The only bad thing about this is that it makes it hard to tell uh, how bright the rooms actually are. And so you can't always tell. Are all three of them going to come after me, or just that one? Was it just that one? Oh, he's got a bow. Okay. Ooh, oh, I thought I could like whip out and hit him with it, but totally missed. He's gonna fall off of there, isn't he? <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised if he did. Gotcha. Marauder Archer. You're not a particularly threatening opponent, dude. Yep, gotcha down. Silver dagger? I've been collecting all these daggers, I don't know why. Could have sworn there are two more people in this room. Where'd they get off to? What's that? Yeah, there's one right there. Hello, who's there? <laughs> it's me. Oh, there's another guy right there. Uh oh, yeah, I hear uh I saw a, a claymore. I think we found the uh leader. <coughs> Bandit ringleader. Ow! Shit! Oh damn! I just saw how low my health was right like the instant before I died. Oh, damn. I should have backed away before fighting them and healed. Ah, uh, my mistake. Live and you learn. I should have an autosave not too far back. Let's see. Yeah, four, four blue blood halls. It's not so bad. That's my save from the beginning of the recording session. Yeah, we'll take the autosave. I think it's the closest to where we were. Alright, so where are we at? How much uh, progress did we lose? Okay, we can't wait while well, enemies are nearby. Let's back up until we can. <laughs> Let's not make that mistake twice, yeah? Heal up. We get a nice autosave every time we rest, too, so that's good. So I'm probably just like one or two battles back from where we were. Yeah, we just gotta fight these guys again, that's all. Hoo ha! Let's do this. We got that one archer guy, and then we got the guy with the sword, right? The uh, spellcaster. What do you call them? Battle mages, yeah. Did I silence something? Oh, there we go. I thought I was silenced because my bumper wasn't working, so I couldn't cast the spell. Dang, I am missing like left and right. That's embarrassing. Yeah, that my face. I'll be healing yourself. I'll burn you. Come on, just die. There you go. Anything useful? Dwarven dagger. We'll take it. We're collecting them now, apparently. Wah! A female Argonian archer. I don't know if I've ever seen one of those before. Female Argonians tend to be mages. I don't, know, I don't know how good an archer Argonian concept would be. <laughs> gotcha. Let's see. Nothing really keep worth taking, huh? Where'd her dagger go? Use my hunter's sight so I can find it. Do you see it? Dang, it's all bright. Let's see. Ah, oh, iron. We don't need it. Or maybe that was the guy we we killed before, but I don't matter. It doesn't matter. I don't matter. Can't wait one in the air. Well, how about once I'm on the ground? Heal up once some more. Oh yeah, and the time passes by uh, almost normally like that, so we uh lose our spell that we cast because it timed out while we were waiting. If you didn't uh, figure that out yourself. Dang it. There we go. Uh, gold and a hammer. We'll take him. I think there's more swords and stuff on here in here too. Yeah, iron short sword. I wish you could dual wield in this game. That would be hilarious. <laughs> well, honestly, when you think about it, really we are. We're like dual wielding magic and a blade. So we've got magic in the left hand and a blade in the right. We can actually do some significant damage, you know? Alright, so let's get our hunter sight and switch back to uh, fireball. I think I'm gonna do the same thing I did last time and take this guy out first. Well, dang, <laughs> I missed him. Fireball was flying past him and he doesn't like recognize. Maybe I should go after this guy or like look around and see what's going on. Why is a fireball flying past my face? But okay. 
He stops in the exact same place as last time, seriously? It's a little bit risky for me to be firing fireballs in that direction, because the more I miss, the more likely it is that I'll hit one of them over there. Let's get this Dang it! Figurement, you're really annoying, you know that? Lol, you fell. His friends still don't know we're here. Whatever. I don't mind it. We'll take on this guy, uh, these guys one at a time if we can. It's not like we get any less experience for it, you know? Yeah, I'm trying to dodge arrows while I cast spells at the same time, and it's tricky to try to have your shots hit while making his miss at the same time. Okay, we took him out without too much trouble, didn't we? Got an archer. Silver dagger, that's it. Alright, I'm gonna smack one of these people and then run. Because, yeah, they know we're here. See the health bar up here? That means we had a successful hit. Alright, so, let's see. Yeah, they know we're here. Once you're engaged in combat, they're pretty, uh... Why did they close the door? So... Interesting. I'm not sure why they closed the doors behind them. It's a high elf, but that's actually not so bad, because that's, uh... That's a mage is gonna be more resistant, or excuse me, more, uh, vulnerable. To magic. Well, actually, if you can't tell, my strategy is to take out the mage first, because she's already been weakened. I don't actually know what I'm backing up into here. Probably gonna be at that end before too long. Yeah, I need to jump over their heads. Do something. Yeah, I'm taking hits here, so I might need to heal soon. This is gonna be a tough fight. Yeah, I hear you. Alright, so that's the, that's the uh, mage taken care of. Uh, let's see, we can heal our wounds, I suppose. I think we're gonna be just slightly faster than this guy, so... Yeah, we shouldn't have much trouble. Uh, we're gonna have to take the door open, won't we? Eh, open the door, open the door, open the door, I'm gonna get hit. Yeah, it's not really worth it running away trying to heal yourself if you're gonna be taking hits so much that it doesn't, uh... You know, like, level out in the end. Anyway, back to our fireball spell. <laughs> Missed me. Yeah, like I say, you're getting close, give him a swing, oh, close him down, and you back away. This guy's a little bit more dangerous because he has a claymore, and it just means that, got. you know, an orc, whoa, with a claymore is not, not an easy opponent a lot of time. Get out of here. Whoa. Yeah, you don't know, I don't think I want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe this guy in, in a contest of blades because he's probably going to kick my ass if I do. I'm just not, uh, like, uh, good enough, I'm not, I'm not tough enough with strength and endurance to really stand up to an orc in a, a match like that. Destruction ceiling, ah. nice. This guy's pretty tough. Orcs have resist magic, uh, that's one of their powers, and so that's why it's taking so many spells to take him out. Oh, come on, dude. I know you're almost down. There we go. Awesome. And we can level up now, too. Very nice. Ooh, orcish boots and orcish grace. He's gonna over-encumber me, but I'll take him. Steel Claymore, I don't need that. Can I wait? Okay, yeah, let's heal. Get a nice auto-save, too. Okay, so... Over-encumbered, what do we drop? We need to drop 48 pounds. Hmm. Let's take a look at this cuirace. And put my boots back on now, I suppose. Uh, let's see. Right now I have on the Fortify Health one. Orcus cuirace. Orcus boots. Okay, I don't need the boots. Or the Curious, because I actually have better stuff in light armor. Oh, that's about it. You know, I suppose I could just keep those <laughs> and then just drop this huge this ring, this really heavy ring. I don't know, I, I kind of feel like I want to keep that, just so I can like, stick it on someone else's person. I don't know. Let's we'll take a minute to see if we can make any new potions with all the stuff we've been picking up. Yeah, I can make a... resist this. Probably make some restore fatigue potions, can't we? Pretty much everything has sore fatigue as one of its uh, effects. I don't have anything we can mix with all the green stain cup cap we found, though. That's that's too bad. Dragon's tongue and spittle sticks. That's damage health. Fly mantia. Can't do anything with that. Let's see. It's an ingredient with lots of good, useful things in it. What can we do with imp gall? Nothing. I don't know how we got four of those though. <laughs> to be perfectly honest, I don't remember killing more than one imp. Mutton, bone meal, okay. Let's see, is this all we're gonna really be able to make? We're gonna have a whole lot of good ingredients. Yeah, we'll just leave it for now. Well, we're still over encumbered, we need to take care of that. Um, 
Oh, I guess I don't need all these daggers, but not, none of them are particularly heavy. <laughs> silver dagger, silver dagger. Let me drop all these arrows, I suppose. I don't know. Like, I want to keep them. Warhammer of weight. Let's get rid of that. I'm like I'm ever going to use it for anything. And then I think I'm going to drop the orcish boots. There we go. That gives us enough to go. <coughs> I should make getting rid of that ring somewhere where I can keep it a priority. We don't have to be carrying that thing around anymore. Oh, tell me they don't have a bed mat around here somewhere. Yeah, there we go. Let's do this. Level up. Awesome. Increase our speed. Let's see. Increase our strength. And... Let's do willpower since we're on the Mage's Killed quest line. Very nice. Just what I'd like to see. What are our stats looking at like right now? Looking pretty good, actually. Our speed's at an active 88 because we've got such so many bonuses on it. The rest of these are at 50 or higher. That's actually pretty good, actually. Yeah, actually. <laughs> uh, we're doing alright. Keep moving here. We need to follow. We had a green marker now, so we must be pretty close to the tomb. We're, but don't forget, we're looking for uh, the Gale's father's coffin. I hear voices or something. Dead Marauder. Oh boy. What got in here and killed them before we got here? Another. Those are trolls. Okay, that's not so bad. I was, hoping I was just hoping they weren't going to be ogres. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> yeah, we can take these guys out without a whole lot of trouble. Trolls are not particularly dangerous opponents. If you let them get close to you, they seem to have the ability to stagger you surprisingly often. So a lot of the times when you take a blow from an ogre, or excuse me, from a troll, it's gonna... What's the word? Make you stagger back and you know, you lose a second. Okay, so wait. Yeah. So which one of these is alive still? Why am I so sneaking? I'm moving so faster if I don't sneak. I'll keep using our spells even though it's ridiculously weak and takes a long time. We do need to raise our destruction skill, and I suppose that using a spell over and over again is actually better than using one spell that does a lot of damage. Yeah, he died from the spell effect, not from me. Troll fat. Troll fat. Let's take out two trolls, that's not so bad. Let's heal up. That should be it, I think, That's as far as what's guarding this guy's uh, tomb. So let's go find him. We have more enemies down here? No, okay. Dead Marauder. It's in the coffin. Some bones. Okay. Must not be the right one. Ah. Manduin's coffin. Manduin's amulet. Nice. And his pelvis. I have found the amulet the Gale needs. I should return it to her immediately. Alright. Let's do that. Sounds like a plan. Look, what the hell? Uh, uh, just stop right there. Alright? I can't let you leave with that amulet. I need it right now. Um, why do you need it? I took the other one, and that should have been enough. I shouldn't have to go through all this just to get rid of her. It's not even as if I was going to keep it forever. I was going to give it back to her once I'd gotten what I wanted. That's not so wrong, is it? Once she helped me advance out of that place and step down, then she could have it back. Why did you have to get in the way? Why are you trying to ruin everything? Oh. He didn't seem very happy with us. So I guess we'll have to kill him. That's how we handle things, right? I'm pretty sure that you can't... Yeah, you can't yield to this guy. So don't don't bother trying to be nice to him. Wow, he's actually doing some, a bit of damage to us. Especially if we can close off his summoned creature in the other room. Switching to, to my sword just because it does a bit more damage quickly than uh, magic. I've defeated Kalfar, who is attempting to manipulate the Gale. I need to give her this information immediately. Uh, anything good in here? Kalfar's key. Maybe he has a good chest. And we don't have a mage's robe yet, so we'll take that, I suppose. Now, I know in Morrowind you can actually wear a mage's robe over your clothes. I'm pretty sure now it's going to override our curious. Yeah. So we're not going to want to do that. And we actually still only, we only still have pants on. We don't have any, uh... What do you call it? Uh... Greaves. All we have is just a pair of pants. So, we'll, whoa! This door opens with Kalthar's key. Oh! So he locked it behind him when he came in. That door opened with the Fort Blue Blood key when we are uh, on the way in there. 